limerick. Uh oh. There. Um, Carol just dropped us off here. She had to come in here to drop Ruben off. So we said, hey, we'll just hitch a ride um, down to Limerick. And our goal today is to hitch all the way to Dublin. I don't know how far we're going to make it. We might end up just taking a bus halfway through. I mean, if we don't make we decided, it. Like, if, it's, if it's getting dark and we're getting worried, we'll catch a bus. Yeah. But if we make it... That's our goal. I think it's like 100 miles. So, I mean... And plus, their speed limits on the interstate is like 75. So it should be pretty good. We'll see. So we'll see who picks us up. Our first adventure. Well, we were waiting there, and it turns out that that's like a really terrible spot to hitch. And we had been like getting signs, like people were like pointing like to us, pointing. And, like pointing like down the road and stuff. And we so weren't we sure what's going, what on. Was going on. So then this lady actually stopped for us, and she said, "You guys are in a really bad spot. You shouldn't be here." So she took us like five or ten minutes down the road and just dropped us off here. And we're actually by a bus stop. So, if we don't get anybody, it's like right here. This is perfect. And it's a really good place to stop, too. So, we'll see if this helps. We have failed. We, I mean, we could have waited for longer, but like, no one is stopping. We, yeah, we've been standing here for about an hour now. And I'm just like, real thumbers, that would be nothing. But like,. There's a bus stop right here, and the bus is going to be here in 10 minutes, so... And the bus would take us directly there. Like, part of my concern is, with people, like, not stopping, maybe they're not going to be stopping, so I'm just concerned that we would make it, like, part of the way there, and then what if there's not a bus from that city? So, this way we know we'll get there. Mm -hmm. So we made it to the hostel. And our room is really nice. Gosh, the hostel is like huge. It, it's big. It, it feels like a hotel. Yeah. Like reception. Well, like... like we have we have key cards to like open the door from like the reception area like into the hostel space, and then to our specific room there is a bathroom. We have an ensuite bathroom. We have a shower. There's a shower in our bathroom, which is right there. This is like, and look how big this room is, and there's eight beds. Eight beds. We're feeling pretty pampered. So that's and been our exciting day. Five o'clock and pitch black. Yeah, it's pitch black. Like, I don't know if you can see that. This is ridiculous. But the hostel's pretty cool.